This is a tutorial of how to play the game Getting Close. So first you start off with three numbers. Same with all your other people. There and over here. Um, so in the game you're not supposed to show them their, your card so you actually keep them up by you. But you start off with the numbers zero, one, and two. In more advanced versions, there are more numbers, but we'll get to that later. So, so um, once you have all your cards and everyone else is playing, someone, um, which would be me, because I would be the dealer, and I would put down the cards, and then you'd have to, whoever did it first, like, once we look at this, say he put his down first, she put hers down second, so say I put mine down last, if they're wrong, then I get both cards. But if they're both right, since I put mine down last, whoever did it first, which was him, he'd get both cards. So one, two, three, flip. He'd get both cards because he was the first one to put it down. And so now we just pull back our cards and try it again. And that's the end of the tutorial video. Well, this is an example um, for the video getting close. If you haven't watched the tutorial, you should go watch that now. So, what we do is, so I'll still, I'll be the dealer. I'll flip the cards really, really fast. Now we just play. All right, now one, one two, two, three, three flip. Well, since since one eight plus five eighths equals six eighths. It is wrong. Because and it's I put to mine down first, so I get them. Yes, now we will play for till this small deck runs out. Hi guys, this is a tutorial for getting even closer. As you saw in the previous games, we only had these cards. As you can see, her and my screen. So, but as we, the getting even closer adds, makes it harder by adding decimals and adding point. So, so the cards that we got were 0 0.5, 1.5, and 2.5. Right, so now we're gonna take these cards which were all the decimals. And we're just gonna put them in and shuffle it up with the deck. As you saw in the previous videos, you should know, already know how to play. It is the same exact concept, but all we got was harder things. And if, you, if none of you actually know the answer to a problem, then you would usually take from the top of the deck but for this example, we're going to be using a decimal and a fraction. So, ready, set, go. Now we try figuring it out. Uh, Three, two, one, flip. Now it's a zero. mix. Of numbers, numbers, so we must figure out what the thing is. Oh, wait, no, it's 2.5. Never mind. Yeah, but you can't really change your answer. <laughs> so, so... Uh, Seven eighths is almost a whole. So, and then this is 2.25, or one point, and one point and a quarter. So, if one, almost one hole plus one hole and a quarter would equal about two holes and a quarter, technically, she would be the closest one, right. So she would get both cards. But say there were to be a tie, whoever put down their card first, which would be her, Me she would still get the cards, but if they were to put them down at the exact same time, we, would, we should split the game. But if, and say there were a three-way tie, then she'd get one, he'd get one, and I would take one from the top of the deck. And as you saw, whoever has the most cards in the end wins. All right, there we go, that's the end of the tutorial.